Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to It's Obvious Gaming. My name is Garrett Drake. I'm joined alongside my best friend in the entire world, Preston Pugh. Preston, it's an honor to have wow. you joining me today. Preston happened to purchase Attack on Titan straight from Japan. The, uh, doesn't Japan have a specific title like the Motherland or something, or is that Russia? Um, that's definitely Russia. Okay. I'm not really sure what, uh, what Japan would be called. So Japan's <laughs> the land flowing with milk and honey then. Sure. Correct? Okay. It well, right to me. straight from Japan, Attack on Titan, Preston and I are fans of the uh, the television program. We've seen season one. Uh, you've, you've seen some of the extra stuff on YouTube with some of the characters. Um, I have not. So you're a little more up to date than I am with the mm -hmm. backstory of these characters. But I gotta say, as you, as everyone, uh, actually I don't even think we've ever talked about Attack on Titan in this show. I think maybe like a little tiny team bit. Okay. Well, in case you guys didn't know, Preston and I and Jacob, believe it or not, are all fans of the show. We're excited for season two. So Preston thought in the meantime, this game looks pretty cool. Ordered the game straight from Japan. And uh, fa thankfully and uh, fortunately, we're very fluent in Japanese. So we understand yes. everything you see on screen here. Mm -hmm. Preston, you've played this for about, you know, what would you say, about almost two hours now? Yeah, probably about. A couple hours. Uh, how are you feeling so far? It's cool. It's like, uh, it feels kind of Dynasty warrior -y. Okay. Um, I used to play those games a long time ago, and I'm pretty sure it's the same company that made this, so it kind of has that feel with, like, you have the big map, and you kind of just are going around taking care of missions and stuff. Mm -hmm. But um, if you're up to the anime, or, you know, spoilers probably, but we're to the part where... Uh, Aaron just turned into a Titan, so he's running around with us, taking care of business. Business. So, so how many uh, how many Titans do you think you've slayed so far? Is it mostly these little guys? You taking on any massive no, I'm ones taking, yet? I'm taking on some big ones. Like this there, guy right there's here. A, there's a media guy right there. Yeah, let's see what you can do here. But um, as you can see, there's a uh, there's like a little diamond yes. there in their arms and stuff. You get like materials. Mm -hmm. uh, for slicing those body parts off. Okay. But obviously, you know. So there's a purpose to go for the additional body parts versus just the neck every time. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Um, see, like, I'm gonna want to get his arm right here. Mm, there it goes. Um, but if, uh, like I said, I speak fluently in Japanese, so I know all the characters have special traits and stuff, like Mikasa, who I'm playing with right now. And sorry, I just, well, as you know. I'm probably not telling the truth. I don't know how to speak Japanese. <laughs> I know this is a surprise, but um, I'm having to figure out everything for myself, so I'm still not completely used to the controls yet. So I'm half the time I'm just flying around, not knowing what's happening. Right. Like right now. Like what in the world? <laughs> but uh, it looks cool. I'll give you that. Yeah, it definitely is fun, especially if you're a. Uh, definitely helps if you're a fan of the show. Like Aaron's over here just wrecking shop. Yeah. <laughs> Um, but yeah, as a, I don't really know what's ever happening. I just see a bunch of squiggly lines on the screen, and I just run to where there's exclamation points, and I kill things. Mm -hmm. So that's essentially what I'm doing right now. And having watched the show, I pretty much know, you know, where I am in the story and what's going on, because I'm pretty sure they're just following like the first season. Okay. Um, so yeah. Well, great. Yeah, it's cool. There's mechanics like my gas is low right now, mm -hmm. so I actually have to switch the tanks out. Um, your blades also, you have to switch out, they can get dull. Um, so you actually can still maneuver if you don't have any gas, but you can't go very fast. You can just use like your zipline things, or your 3D maneuver gear, if I believe that's what it's called. Yeah, yeah, th yeah. <laughs> 3D maneuvering gear, I think. So is the blue your health? Oh no, that's, no. that's your health. No. What is that? That's what? my like special meter. Okay. Um, uh, so I'm trying health? to figure out what all these meters are here. Yeah, the the meter on the left is your special, which if you push right trigger, you can like get a power up, and all the guys following you around, they'll get a power up as well. The uh, all right, this is a boss. Oh boy. Um, he's a tubby one. He's ready to roll. Mm -hmm. Look at that belly. I'm gonna go pat it for him. Mm. Pat it with your uh, your blades for me. Yes. Mm hmm. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I think he's a bit bit hungry. I'll feed him. Yep, there he is. Or no, I don't know if that's him. But yeah, the 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 fire guys on fire. They typically um. Uh, see, Mikasa can like you see how I slice the neck like eight times or right. three times. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's her like special ability because she's just a badass. She most certainly is. That's for sure. 
Oh, got him. So I'm gonna try and get this material in there. Chop it off. But it's cool because you can like uh, target their legs and stuff too, and they'll, um, depending on like how strong they are, it might take a couple of hits. But yeah, I got his leg right there. Um, so now he's like crawling on the ground and stuff. That's pretty cool. So wh what exactly can you do with these materials? Is it for crafting or upgrading? Yeah, crafting. Like there's different, there's like actual gear. Like you don't use the same swords. Like it's, it's actual, like they look different. Mm -hmm. They do different things. Like some are more powerful, but their reach isn't as long. That's pretty cool. Um, so kind of just the play style. Like you like, my blades are a little dull right now. So I'm going to swap them out. Um, I think right now, I'm just, oh, he needs help, so. Now, is this yeah. game sort of mission-based? Is it, you have to kill a certain amount of titans in this, this area um, to progress, or? I think I'm protecting a tower or something right now. Like I said, uh, I have no clue what's happening. Mm -hmm. Like, I think this person needs my help. So I'm gonna go help. Okay. Um, as of now, like the missions are pretty much the same when you're here, just the the environments differ, and I'm pretty sure from what I've seen, I'm gonna be able to play as Aaron as in Titan form in just a second. That's cool. Um, you certainly aren't showing any mercy to these what? Titans, especially <laughs> that little guy. <laughs> That's cool because you can like, because they'll, they'll like be down. looking at you and stuff. Yeah. But I can like go in really fast, um, hit them harder. Like if I have enough uh, gas in my tank, I can like fly towards them extra fast, which I think does extra damage. Um, like right here, I like go really fast at them. Now, have you ever rushed one like that and they grab you out of midair or something? They can grab you, yes. Okay. And you have to just like smash. See these guys? Since I helped them out, now they'll give me stuff. I do my little chest pat heart thing that's and cool will, and i can even get him to come help me he's a level c character though so i have all b's on my team so there's right. not really a point um i know if you push down on the d-pad you can like give them different commands but my japanese is a little rusty these days so mm -hmm. i'm not exactly <laughs> sure what it does it's been a while yeah we're not quite as cultured as we used to be unfortunately no. now if i remember correctly is this prior to them being part of the scout regiment um, I think so. I'm judging yeah. based on the back of their jackets, because yeah, that's yeah. not the Scout Regiment I think, emblem. No, yeah, I'm pretty sure that comes after. Because this is, like, I think the first, like, actual battle. Because if I'm not mistaken, Aaron goes down in the very first fight. Right. Um, but uh, unlike the uh, television show, um, you actually do play as Aaron, and you take out quite a few Titans as him. Right. Um, whereas in the show, he's... As far as I know, he's never actually beaten a Titan without being a Titan. Mm -hmm. Which just yeah. goes to show how hardcore Mikasa is. Yeah. Mikasa! Uh, see. Oh yeah, boy. Man. Yeah. You're, have you ever died in this game? Um, no, I have not. Mm. I am on the verge, though. See, you don't have that much health, which makes sense. So you have like uh, healing supplements down there. Okay. Um, but yeah, I gotta refuel my stuff. This guy's crawling towards mm, me. He's gonna get you. Oh, that was close. Oh. But yeah, if they're they're looking at you, it's really hard to uh, to attack them. So that's when I go for like limbs and stuff mm -hmm. to kind of distract them. And it'll say they're like if they're looking at you or not with that eyeball up there. But I think Aaron's about to help me take care of this guy. I like Maybe. to see him do it. No, if he's running away. Because he knows you have it under control here. I'm trying to. He's definitely typically all the other titans just go down in like one hit, but this guy being a higher level character, bossish character. Mm -hmm. I got him right here. Yeah, I just thought uh it could have been appropriate for us to both wear our Scout Regiment t shirts today for this video, but it didn't even cross my mind until just it didn't now. Cross my mind either. There's the fat guy that we saw in that cutscene. Mm-hmm. Take his arm off, get some of that materials. Oops. Get him in the gizzard. Oh. 
be able to get his legs and then it should be pretty easy after that. Oh crap. Oh no. Oh no. It certainly is um, a jolly I'm use one. My uh, power up. Okay. So I think my health goes up, and see, I have like a boost now. Yeah, that's convenient. Almost got that left leg. So if they lose both their arms, what can they do exactly to attack you? Um, I think they can like slither around and stomp you or something. Okay. Mm, got him. Yeah, no. But yeah, every fight you're like you get like a little rating as well. Okay. Um, and I did not do very well in that one, so it was a bronze. Here we go. I think this is the part where they're all stuck in that building and right. they like all shoot them uh -huh. when they get inside, I think. He's an angry elf. <laughs> Oddly enough, I know we both agree that we prefer watching the show in Japanese because we tried watching it briefly in English and it just didn't feel right. It doesn't. I don't want to be like one. I know there are like guys that are like stupid about stuff like that, but I don't know. In some shows, like the English just isn't done very well, mm -hmm. which I tried listening to this one in English. It wasn't as, you know, they're, they're getting better and better. Like Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z in Japanese just sounds absolutely dumb to me. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Goku sounds like a female. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, definitely this show, I, I prefer um, the Japanese with right. English subtitles for sure. And that kind of just like, when I'm watching an anime, like, I just feel like that that's just kind of what I like about it is just reading the subtitles. Mm -hmm. So, but yeah, these are the, um, in these areas here, you can talk to dudes. Uh, I don't know, I'm talking to all of them because maybe there's a trophy for it. Right. Um, but you can also upgrade your stuff here. Like, I'll show you some of that. Um, I'm pretty sure this... This means this, this option. I'm pretty sure this means sword. This means your gas canister, and that means your 3D gear. Okay. Yeah. So these are some of the swords you can look at. That's cool. Yeah, and they the top one means damage. The second one I think means um, reach, and okay. then the third one is like durability. I think. Maybe. I see. But yeah, you can see how they all you know they actually look different. So you're not wearing the same thing and right, stuff. Right. That but is cool. Yeah, I'm pretty um satisfied with what I have right now. Um, I think later on your materials actually come into play as well, which okay. you can actually purchase from these guys. Like, this is new, but I don't know what it is, so I just go by the little icon up top. Yeah. So, but yeah, as of now, I don't think I need any of that. But, um... That's cool, they give you the option to customize, though. Yeah. I like that. Sure. Yeah, then you come, uh, set the Admin. mission over here. Hopefully, I can take on Aaron now. Yeah, I'm interested to see that for sure. But yeah, gameplay I've seen, um, I don't, it might get repetitive. I don't know. It's definitely, I'm just trying to think of what you could do in an Attack on Titan game and not make it like mm -hmm. this. Like, as far as it goes, like, I don't see how you can really get any better than this. Right. I mean, it's pretty, you know, it's following the show pretty mm -hmm. good. It's looks pretty good, plays it's well. Playing well. I mean, I actually, I really like how when you're, Flying around the um, the cords from your um, Omni Gear 3D stuff uh, actually goes to the buildings and stuff. Right. Like that's really really cool. Um, I like the destruction like, here too. Yeah. It's awesome. Definitely. So, and this is good. Like switching up the gameplay. Like I've been flying around the entire time, so it's good to try something different. And I know you can also go outside the walls as well. It's cool. Um, on horseback and stuff. Really? Mm -hmm. That's cool. Can you like explore and stuff? Uh, I don't know if you can explore, but there's combat and stuff. That guy just uh, dolphin dive towards nice. you. An old fashioned slug fest here. Is this wall Maria over behind? Is that the biggest wall? Um, the yeah, final, I think that's the, the, final the wall? outer wall, yeah. Okay. It's been a while since I've seen the show. So I might not be too up to date on all that stuff. All I know is this game makes my PlayStation 
Ghost's fan go louder than like The Witcher does. Right. <laughs> I noticed that. Working hard. Now, is there a release date announced for the United States for this? For I don't this think game? it's announced. Now. Okay, it's just confirmed that at some point it's going to be coming to the United States. Yeah. Of course, very one copy is already here in the United States, it and I'm it's sure, in our possession, I'm sure ladies a few and gentlemen. Are. Um, I was surprised how fast it got here. I ordered it from Hong Kong. It's Hong Kong. And uh, it took like two days to get here. I don't which, know what these guys are doing dolphin diving at you. That's just what they do. That guy's jolly for sure. They smile all the way to the grave, that's for sure. Yep. Hmm. I gotta say, I'm very excited for season two. I really like season one. Uh, like we said, spoilers, we've been talking about season one a bit, but uh, the way season one ends definitely leaves you begging for season two, to say the for least. Sure. I know that it's, it's like pretty far on in the uh, the um, comic the series. Comics or the, oh, the manga books, or yeah. Whatever it's called. Um, but uh, I really don't want to get into that. I right. just kind of want to wait for this. I agree. The show. I believe that's a boss character or something. Now, I don't recall Aaron like kind of flaming like you are. Is this like a mm -hmm. power up you have or something? Uh, maybe either that or I'm just damaged and I'm healing or something. Oh my goodness, you nailed that guy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes, yes. Goodness. <laughs> Look at that little guy. <laughs> oh, <I> did nothing <laughs> to him. I want to see you football like punt someone across the city. <laughs> there we go. I guess that was it. I wonder if I get to fight her. I know, I was thinking that. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. That'd be awesome. That has to happen. Oh, especially like flying through, through the, the trees and, and stuff. stuff yeah. To get her, yeah. Which the tutorial of this game is actually you're in the woods, like going through trees and stuff. Like fighting, training and everything? Yeah, fighting those um, uh, like wood cutouts they have right. with like the pads and stuff on their neck and stuff. That's cool. Yeah. That's like a perfect place for a tutorial in mm -hmm. a game for this. Me having no clue about anything in the anime and stuff, I thought that was just really cool. I kind of figured something was up with Aaron mm -hmm. when he got eaten by the Titan. And, you know, obviously when you saw him, you, you knew what was going on. But there for a few episodes, I, like, legitimately thought he was dead. Right. I was like, man, that's ballsy. Yeah. Because <laughs> I heard, that was one thing I heard about this show is that uh, they kind of do kill off characters pretty easy and stuff. Right. So. Which I always enjoy in a show keeps you on your uh, toes. Yeah, absolutely. I like unpre unpredictability. Is mm -hmm. that a word? Unpredictability? I want it to be. I think it is a word, yes. I'm going to look it up real quick. I like things to be unpredictable if it's not a word. <laughs> Unpredictability? I think it is. Yeah. Unpredictability. Non-predictable. Yep. Yeah. Thank the Lord. That would have been really <laughs> stupid. Now, do you think eventually something's going to happen there? Between the two of them? Yeah. Um, I kind of hope there isn't. Me too. It's like, because they're almost like brother and sister when they were kids. Yeah. It just would be kind of weird to me. Yeah. I kind of like that in the show, though, how they're not just forcing like a romance right. as well. I agree. Um, Plus, I feel like Mikasa is so uh, independent and such a badass that you shouldn't really yeah. need like a romance. She don't need no man. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> I don't think she needs it. Foreman probably does. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. He's nuts. Ellen Yeager. Now, did you watch the... Uh... The Junior High show. No, have you seen any of it? Yes. How much? It's hilarious. How much have you like seen? Like five it? episodes. Okay. The first episode is very funny. Mm-hmm. Because they just all like they all take their character their like character traits and just like 
make fun of them, essentially. Like, Mikasa, there's one episode where Aaron is sick or something, and uh -huh. she literally can't function. Like, she's just moping around everywhere because he's not there. That's funny. Um, Armin is just a baby and it has to carry a blanket around with him the entire time. It's not too different from and his uh, mature version of the show counterpart. Yeah, pretty much. And, um, and instead of the Titans eating humans, they eat human food. Right. So they're like at high school and all the Titans are taking their food. So Aaron goes on, his, not Aaron, yeah, Aaron goes on his rant, like giant monologues, but instead of about his family being killed, he's talking about how they took his cheeseburger. Mm. So. It sounds like such a struggle. <laughs> yeah. And uh, Attack on Titan Junior High. Yeah, it's, it's pretty funny though. Excellent. Well, I gotta say, this is probably actually, actually after this cutscene is an excellent time to uh, call it quits. I would have to agree with you. But I would have to say, uh, I greatly appreciate you taking the time to order the game and ship it all the way from the other side of the planet so we can enjoy it today. And our friends uh, that joined us in this video, if you enjoyed it, please give it a like. Comment down below. Let's start a conversation. If you're a fan of Attack on Titan, let's keep the comments exclusive to this video so we don't spoil it for anyone else. And the spoilers are in the title, so if it was spoiled for you, you had, had been warned, so I apologize. But as I said, if you're a fan, let's talk about it down below. I mean, maybe at some point we'll do a podcast about season two or something, do a review of it or, or something like sure. that. But uh, we're fans of the show. If you are too, let's talk about it. We're It's Obvious Gaming. My name's Garrett Drake. That's Preston Pugh. We're It's Obvious Gaming. I think I said that a few times now. Let's, let's say it again. We're It's Obvious Gaming. We're It's Gaming. Obvious Gaming. Don't forget it. <laughs> we'll catch you again next time. Have All a good right. one.